it's Audrine. You may also know me as Honeybuzz on Instagram or Pastel K on TikTok. It's great to see you again. Well, it's great for you to see me again. Um, thank you for checking out this video. Today, I am going to be doing a haul from Uvimi. They sent me some wigs and some clothes and I'm so excited. If you've never heard of Uvimi before, they are a kawaii fashion brand. They sell a lot of adorable J fashion items. The products are so cute. Um, I've gotten a lot of wigs from them before. I've gotten a couple clothes, I've gotten some shoes. If you have never heard of them, then you've probably not seen my other YouTube videos. Please check them out if you have the time. And you can use my discount code HONEYBUZZ at checkout and you will save some money and it would also support me. Um, so I hope you guys like the stuff that I got and I'm going to just jump right in. And this is the first thing I got. It's this super cute blue wig and it's called the Lita Siam Blue Gradient Wig. It's super cute. I'm going to go ahead and pull that out because I want to start with a I want to start with a wig before I start with clothes. So I'm really excited. I don't have a ton of like blue only wigs, even though blue is my favorite color. And so this is what it looks like in the bag. It has two little buns. Uh, I'm gonna pull it out. I'm pretty hyped. Great. Got it. So here it is, um, not on me. I think it's really pretty. The curls are really nice. I'm probably gonna, when I have it on, put my fingers through it because they're a little stiff. But the color is really pretty. It's like this like light mint. It really does match a lot of colors that I already have. So if you're trying to do like a mint sort of look, I definitely, this is a really bomb color. And the inside is a lighter color and it has all of these little wefts and it has the little adjustable straps on both sides as well as the two clips and it has these two little little bottoms that <laughs> that'll go on my head like this but with a wig so it'll match so this is what it looks like on me uh i think i'm going to uh brush it out with my fingers, it, it's really short. Oh yeah, I like that way more. So um, I think the volume when I do that is really cute. So this is me with the wig on. I think it's really cute. My eyebrows don't match, which is a little unfortunate. I I wasn't too sure what the colors were gonna look like. And I think that with it being really poofy, it's really cute. I'm probably gonna cut the bangs. So they're straight bangs and it's really shiny in the ring light, but that personally doesn't bother me. But maybe if you're looking for one that looks a little bit more realistic, don't get this one. But I think this one's gonna be really cute for pictures. and. I'm going to turn around for you so you can see what the back looks like. So this is what the back looks like. Cool. It's easy to put on. It is comfortable. I'm a little sweaty, but that's not the wig's fault. And yeah, I really like it. I'm definitely going to wear this for a look. And I also do think that this wig is a lot more green than I thought it was going to be in the picture. It looks a lot more like blue. I'm not upset about it because I actually don't really have any well I have one wig that has mint in it but it's not like fully mint so I'm really excited to have a new wig color yeah I really like it I'm definitely gonna wear this for a look and um I am going to do one of my one of the clothes that I got and then I'm gonna like accessorize it well you know what? I'm just gonna do it. I'm not gonna explain it to you. I'm just gonna do it. So I'm going to go on to the next item now. And the next item that I'm going to try on is this, which is a very cute pink dress. I'm really curious on how this is gonna fit on me. And so let me take it out of the bag to show you what it looks like. So this is the dress. The dress is a lot more like coral than it is like a pastel pink. And it has a, 
a, a mesh sort of fabric on top of it which is pretty cute i just didn't know that it was all over the whole dress the straps are just nice elastic bands and the back stretches so it can fit better and so does the middle it stretches and the bottom has this really cute lace and it has this little bow which admittedly maybe isn't the best bow but i think i'm gonna work with it later i'm gonna put this on um uh can i do that or should i do oh, wait okay i'm gonna jump i'm gonna i'm gonna do another another transition are you ready i'm here did it work did i do it i hope so so i put on the dress and it's cute i actually really like it i'm gonna show you what i look like full body arms are weird arms are so weird i feel like i want to put a mesh top under this so i might try that um after i show you guys what it looks like on me i'm gonna i'm gonna show you and then i'm gonna put on some accessories and stuff because i want to take pictures too so uh full body time now so sorry i don't have the best way to show you but this is what it looks like and i think that it's really cute i'll turn around And I think I'm also going to add like a petticoat under it. So now that you've seen it, I'm going to put on accessories and then I'm going to tell you more about the dress. So I will be right back. So I accessorized and I'm actually really happy with how the look turned out. I'm going to put a picture of me actually in a picture here with all of them. The dress is really comfortable. I think it actually fits super nice on me. The little, the stretchy parts are mad nice. It like... It makes it fit real nice and it's comfortable. It's not itchy at all. And I put a little petticoat under it. And so it's like fluffier. And I also just added some hair accessories onto my new wig. Put these little things on top of the bun. I don't know what they are, but I got them from Daiso. And I think it looks really cute, pretty extra. I added some pink onto the top of my elf ears as well. And so I definitely recommend this dress if you're looking for like a cute pink simple dress. Oh, please use my discount code HONEYBUZZ if you choose to buy either of these things. And I'm going to go ahead and move on to the next item. So the next wig that I'm going to try on is this. It's called Harjuku Lolita Long Roll Wig and I'm going to pull it out of the package. Uh, and also all of the wigs come with a wig cap which is super nice. I leave my wig caps all the time honestly so it's really nice to get them every time that I have a new wig. And so this is what it looks like in the bag. It has some purple in it and some pink. Well a lot of pink and some purple and I'm going to open it up. So this is what it looks like outside of the bag and it's really pretty. It has like little streaks of purple in it and it feels really nice. It feels really nice. And the inside is the same as this wig that I'm wearing right now. It, oh, except it doesn't have the little clip-ins at the top. I, I'm bad. I personally don't really use those, but if that's something that you use, maybe this isn't the wig for you. But it's so cute. It's pastel. It's pink. It's not coral. And so I'm going to go ahead and take off all my hair accessories and stuff and then put this one on instead. So this is the wig on me and I actually think that it's like super pretty. I think that this wig actually matches this dress a lot better, but I am going to try a different dress with this wig because I, oh, I don't think I said I have three wigs and I have three outfits. Well, one's a shirt and two are dresses. And so every wig, I'm gonna do a different clothing item with it. Yep. But this wig is so cute. I need to cut the bangs, but that's pretty standard for you Vimmies wigs. It's long, it's really soft, and I actually really like the colors and how it shows up on camera. It's like a really pastel pale pink, and I think it's really pretty, and I do not have this shade of pink in a wig yet, so I, I really like it. I think that the top of my head is kind of flat, but I think the top of my head is just kind of flat. So I'm going to turn around and show you what the back of my head looks like. This is what it looks like. And this wig's really long. I'd say it's a little weird here because there's some shorter parts and some longer parts. So the layering is a little odd, but it's not something that you can really notice too much. And I'm sure if you straightened it, it wouldn't have that issue. 
very cute colors very soft um i think that it looks pretty nice in the light but also a downside to this wig it looks like is it's shedding a lot uh can you see all of those in my in my candy um so that's kind of a bummer but i would I would wear this one out. I'm going to wear this one out. And I'm going to show you the next thing that I got, which is this dress. And I'm really excited for this dress because it's pink and blue. It's super cute. It's pretty extra and that's right down my alley. And so let me pull that out of the bag for you. And this is what it looks like in the bag. The colors look a lot different than they do on the website. So that's kind of a bummer, or at least in the bag, that's how it looks. So this is what it looks like out of the bag. It's really cute, but the colors are a lot different than the website. These are like, it's like a vintage pink and blue instead of like a pastel. And it has this on the sleeve, which is really pretty, a little flower. This is a sleeve. <laughs> it has really cute stars. And I really just like the little details that they added into it, like the lace and the flowers and it has more lace here and more flowers and so i'm going to go ahead and put this on and show you what it looks like on maybe maybe accessorize first i don't know okay i'm gonna try this and this is what the look looks like now that it's all done I decided to accessorize and I really really like how this look turned out. It's really similar to my aesthetic but it's also pretty different. Like it's more cottage core than like Mary Kay. And also something I learned while putting on this dress is make sure that you take off your candy because this part is not very stretchy. So if you have a ton of candy on, it does not want to go over the candy. Um. And so I'm actually going to try a different way of showing you guys the rest of my outfit. Wish me luck. So here I am. I think that this works a lot better. It's a lot cuter here. And this is what the dress looks like. It's pretty long. It goes down to like my knees and this part is not tight. So it can fit a lot of sizes, which is really cool. I was thinking I might put like a belt around here or something later and I, I don't know. It's really comfortable. It's very soft. The fabric's pretty thin, which is like not see-through, but like light sort of fabric. And so I won't be sweating too much, just a little bit. <laughs> and so this part's really cute. It goes like all the way around here. I'll show you the back side of this too. And the back side has the little uh, crisscrossy bow, uh, ribbon. It, it doesn't like, oh, there's hair in the way. I have these, this ribbon on the back, which is really cute, but I can't adjust it. But I really like this, and it's kind of different for me, and so I really like that. Definitely recommend this dress. Yeah, I think that's it. Um, I'm going to go ahead and move back to where I was before, and I'm going to show you the next wig that I got. Hi! So, as you can see, my makeup's different because I didn't finish this video in a day. So it's the next day, I put on some more makeup, and I'm going to go into the next two items, which first is this wig. I'm super excited for this. I have a wig that's really similar to this, but it's long. It's also from you, Vimmy. And I'm really excited for a shorter one because I really like these colors on me, but going outside in a long wig gets pretty hot. And so I thought that having a shorter wig might be nicer for when I'm going outside. Whenever I get to go out and hang out with my friends again, I think that this will be a really good wig for that. So I have it here and I'm gonna pull it out. This is what it looks like in the, the net. And here's the wig. I think this is really cute. The wig is kind of flat, but that'll be really easy for me to fix either by just putting my fingers through it, which will make it a little bit floofier. And then later I also use a hair crimper to sort of give my wigs more texture and then I brush it all out, but that's not for this video. So I'm going to go ahead and put this, oh, I'm so silly. This is the inside of the wig. Uh, and it is similar to the first wig where it has both of these little adjusty straps and then the clip-ons on the front. Which is really nice because if I'm going out, that's more important because I'm not just standing around taking pictures. So let me 
Let me get this on my head. I'm, I was trying to think of a cool transition to do, like... Okay, H hear me out, okay? Wow, did that transition work? I don't think that one did, not gonna lie. But so here's the wig on me, and I think that it's really cute. I really like the colors. It's pink and blue, and in the back there's like a, it's a mitt, which is very cute. And the bangs are pretty long, and I don't really like how they look when I swept them to the side. So I think after I show you guys my my next item, I'm going to also cut the bangs for pictures, but it's really easy to put on. It's super comfortable. I do think that I like my longer one more because it has more white in it. And I feel like the white with the pink and the blue, like, I don't know. I, I just liked it more with some more white. So I didn't really expect it to have none, but I really do like the colors. It is kind of flat, but I'm just going to do it. I said I'm gonna use my hair crimper and I'm going to brush it out and... And I'm going to show you the back of my wig. Here it is. And so the last thing that I got is this and it is a rainbow sweater and I think that it looks really cute. I love rainbow stuff, obviously, and so I just had to see what the colors actually look like and I'm going to pull it out. So this is what it looks like in the bag, already super cute. And here it is. This is really cute. It has this really cute heart embroidery on it and I really don't have a lot of turtlenecks, so I'm excited for the fact that it's a turtleneck. Very stretchy, very nice. And the colors are really cute. And I'm gonna go ahead and try it on. Did it work? That one might be a little not working because I did add a lot of other stuff I was even putting on the shirt. But I really like this shirt. It's really comfortable. The whole fabric is really stretchy and heart's really cute. And this is what the back looks like, I guess, if you wanna see that. And I'm also going to go on my bed to show you what the rest of the shirt looks like. But I definitely recommend this shirt. It's really cute, really comfy, colors are nice. So here's the rest of me with the shirt on. It goes pretty low. I just put my, I just tucked it into my skirt. If you like this sweater, definitely check it out. I definitely recommend it. Everything that I got from Uvimi was super cute. My favorite item I think was actually the dress. I really liked the dress because it was something that was kind of different for me and I just wanted to try something new and I think that it worked out pretty well. So thank you so much for checking out this video. I'm just gonna say bye here because, um, you know, why not? I don't do videos on my bed a lot. So, um, I hope you like my bed. Got my daughter Molly above me when I sleep. She's wonderful. If you couldn't tell, she's wearing one of the wigs now from you, Vimmy. <laughs> um, and just thank you so much for checking out this video. It really means a lot to me. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I hope you have an amazing day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.